In this problem, I need to solve for what a and b are equal to and find the measure of each unknown angle. To do that, I need to find an angle relationship I can work with. So first, notice that 4a minus 17 and a plus 3, 4 are alternate exterior angles. What do you know about alternate exterior angles? Well, they're equal to each other. So I can set up an equation where 4a minus 17 has to be equal to a plus 34. And I can solve this equation for a. To solve this, let's add 17 to both sides first. If you do that, say 34 plus 17 is just 51. So 4a equals a plus 51. Then just subtract a from both sides. 4a minus a is just 3a. So I have 3a equals 51. Finally, just divide by 3 to solve for a. And 51 divided by 3 is just 17. Therefore, a is just equal to 17. Now, let's use that to solve for a plus 34 and 4a minus 17, so I can find those unknown angles. So first, a plus 34, to find that angle, just plug in a equals 17. So I can just rewrite that as 17 plus 34. And 17 plus 34 is just 51. So therefore, this angle down here is just equal to 51 degrees. And remember, this angle down here and that angle up there are the exact same due to alternate exterior angles. So I can write this whole thing as 51. And let me just write that A is equal to 17 since we needed to solve that. Now, how can I solve for B and what 9B plus 57 is equal to? Well, I know that 9B plus 57 and 51 are supplementary angles. Therefore, I can write 9B plus 57 plus 51 is equal to 180 degrees. So all you need to do is just subtract 51 and subtract 57 from both sides. So 180 minus 51 and minus 57. And if you do all that math, what you're gonna find is that B is just equal to 72. And then just divide by nine. And if you do 72 divided by nine, that's just eight. So therefore B is equal to eight. And actually, let me write that up here. So B just equals eight and we solve for both A and B. And now I need to find what 9b plus 57 is equal to. To do that, I'll just do 180 minus 51, since these are supplementary angles. And that's just equal to 129. So I can rewrite all of this at just 129. So I've solved for a and b, and I found each unknown angle in this problem.